The official launching of the Bulolo Water Supply Project will now see work begin to bring the project to life to support schools, business houses, churches, as well as the households. The board chairman of Water PNG, Ambassador Aiwa Olmi, in his speech expressed that Papua New Guinea is one of the lucky countries in the world to have clean drinking water as compared to countries he has served in. They lack clean water. They drink from open drains. They use water from dirty drains in the urban areas. In Papua New Guinea, we are lucky. We have clean, very clean, healthy water. Speaking for his electorate, the Bulolo MP and Deputy Prime Minister Sam Basil stressed that with the district having 110 wards and six local level governments, equal distribution is a real challenge. In reality, you may have triple town inside of Bulolo district, and you may have Mumei or Genex Station, you may have Bulolo town, now you may have Wow town. Brooklyn resource, Naskanim resource. And by remaining challenged, so you may all get a time. The Bulolo MP also stressed that there must be cooperation from all levels in the district in order for work to be completed. Let me ask him, Mayor Brayumi, will you see that? Or Councillor Brayumi in a ward area in Saro Town? But you must hold him on, stand up one time, display contract and make sure that this project you must come up. The Minister for State Enterprise and keynote speaker at the ceremony, William Duma, expressed that apart from the water project, the developments taking place at Bulolo Township as a whole is impressive. Bulolo, you got all good road. Now town am clean. There's a big change. This is like I talk pizza, you saw him on same. He got stability. Now good leadership. Now this is a place here. Richard Shise, NBC National News, Lake.